Hey, what's up, you two? I'm Zeke, and welcome to the Dream Green Show. I'm going to bring you a quick little market analysis on Tesla hours before Battery Day, so I can show you guys predictions of the price point on what could happen after Battery Day live streams. Don't forget to sign up for Weeble using the link down in the description. Deposit $100 and receive one free share valued up to $1,600. That could be your free share of Tesla just by clicking the link down in the description. But let's go ahead and dive into this video all right quick. It's gonna be a quick one. So we're over on Thinkorswim. This is the four hour 180 day chart. That means every bar on here represents four hours of the trading day over the last 180 days. If you guys are subscribed to my channel, you will know that I drew out these lines a week ago. And so far they're holding true to the resistance lines and the support line. And I drew out these right here and it's holding true so far if we zoom in. So this is, I'm gonna give a quick price prediction. Um, Tesla is trending down at the moment, all the way back down to one of the support lines I drew out over a week ago. So it could use the 180 day simple moving average as the support line, or it could use this line that I drew out where it touches multiple um, points on this uptrend. Let me zoom out so I can show you guys where it touches multiple points on this uptrend it could use that one as the support line so it's kind of touching right there right here right here and then it could pull back to right here as the support line or it could also use the sideways horizontal support line where it did have a bounce off of 330 dollars as the support line now if great news come out i believe that tesla would make a double top a double top is two hills so that's the top of one hill it comes down and then it comes back up to touch the 538 dollar line again that is a double top but that's only if amazing news come out but what elon musk tweeted the other day was that um major production of what he's going to announce today won't really begin to pick up until uh 2022 which to me a long-term investor is not bad okay 2022 is only two years away but a lot of people are trying to make money on Tesla. Now, they didn't like that tweet to see that, hey, this won't go into production until 2022. So a lot of short-term investors did not like that tweet, which is why it's trending down right now. So if, if amazing news does not come out, Tesla could come down from the $422 price point all the way to $368, which would be a negative 13%. Or if really bad news come out, I believe that it would play somewhere around its support line of $326, $325, right around in this area right here. If it does come down to $325, I'm probably gonna pick up another share of Tesla because I think that's a, a decent price to get Tesla at, at $325. Now, if you watched my last video, you know the words that you need to look out for is 400 watt hours per kilogram. If he says those, that means he's, he got a plan in place to make an electric vehicle aircraft, so. A compelling aircraft, you only really need about 400 watt hours per kilogram, provided your, the, your, the percentage of sell on the craft, on the, on the aircraft is high. It doesn't need to be anywhere near as high as the, it is on a rocket. Um, but if it's sort of at the 70% level um, at 400 watt hours per kilogram, um, you can do very decent range. If he does say that, and he does announce the million mile battery and some other news that we don't even know about, Tesla could shoot from the $420 price point all the way up to the double top with a gain of 28%. Um, that could happen over the next couple of days. That could happen. That could happen right after um, he announces everything he needs to announce this on battery day. So that 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 is our price prediction anywhere that is going to be a double top at around five hundred thirty eight dollars for again twenty eight percent in the next couple of days. Or he doesn't announce nothing really spectacular and it drops uh, twenty four percent all the way down to three hundred twenty four dollars. See, Tesla is very volatile. It can either swing up really high or swing down really low. Because right now the RSI is right in between in the middle at the 50. So it's not overbought, it's not oversold. The MACD is right there in the middle. So everything is really depending on the news of Tesla, of what Elon Musk has to say on Tesla Battery Day, because the price is not overbought or oversold. When I say overbought, that means it's overvalued right here on the RSI. That means uh, usually when it's overvalued, people start to sell off. And usually when it's oversold, people start to buy back in because it's undervalued. As you can see, it correlates with the chart, the RSI indicator. So right now it's in the middle. 
the MACD is in the middle, and we're just waiting on some news catalysts to move the price point of Tesla. Now let's go ahead and zoom in on another time frame. Uh, this is the one hour, 20 day chart. And right now, if you use the SMA, the simple moving average as the support, it's still trending down at the moment. But right now, it is still above the simple moving average, which is a good uh, trend to show that if he said, if he has good news, that the price will go up. And once again, it's not really overbought or oversold on the one hour chart. But let's zoom in on the day. On the day, uh, just because of his tweet, um, Tesla has been trending down from yesterday. Yesterday, it closed at $455, and today it is at uh, $422, and that's uh, a loss of 6% over the course of a day just because of what he tweeted about um, Tesla not really picking up the production of what he's going to announce today. That production is not going to really pick up until 2022. And and on the day it is trading below the simple moving average line so that's something to consider right there everything is kind of pretty much going to go sideways from here it's, it's pretty much going to trade sideways from here until he announces what he has to announce on battery day so um so from here on until around 3.30, my time, 4.30, everybody else time, Tesla's gonna stay in the 420, 400, $40 price range. It's not really gonna change much and we're just waiting on the news. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Uh, Elon Musk is going to announce something big on Tesla battery day to drive the price all the way back up to its all time high or he's not going to be so spectacular and the price could fall down up to 25 percent over the course of the next couple of days either way it's good for me if it falls down 25 percent i'm going to pick up more shares if it skyrockets to the top i make more money that way but i am a long-term investor him starting production in 2022 really does not scare me let me know what you guys think down in the comment section on your price predictions on what you think tesla is going to do what can he possibly announce to drive the price above the old all-time high uh what could he not announce to drive the price all the way down below 325 dollars but other than that make sure that you click the link down in the description sign up for weeble um, deposit 100 and you could receive a free share of tesla to get you started on your tesla journey today but other than that i'm zeke bringing you the dream green show and i'm out peace